What is going on, guys? It is Rocker XX Dakota here, bringing you a TNA universe. And um, first of all, I want to say that yesterday I did not upload because, uh, well, I had a lot of thinking in my mind. Um, mostly about um, love. Let's just say that. Um, let's not get any further with that. You guys don't want to hear about my love life. But if you do, you guys should totally comment on uh, the video saying, I want to hear about your love life. Maybe if we get enough likes, I mean likes, comments, I'll make, maybe I'll do it, but, um, alright, let's see if there's any news, alright, there's nothing really other than that, but we are gonna be in Extreme Rules this Sunday as well, which is kinda, kinda weird, so I'm gonna have to do, uh, an Extreme Rules pay-per-view and a Survivor Series pay-per-view, let's just say that, alright, but let's go to, um, alright, who's gonna be the number one contender for the X Division Championship, and apparently it's Sting, well, that's uh, kind of weird. All right, let's go to the next one. Number one contenders match: Gail Kim versus Velvet Sky. All right, let's do this. Let's just show Velvet Sky that she is not who we think she is. Let's turn the entrances off because I really don't care that much about entrances in the first place. Um, yeah, I don't care about entrances. But yeah, yesterday I did not upload because um, I kind of feel sad. I don't know why. Uh, that's all I say. I, I don't want to get too much into it, but uh. You know, it gets, gets kind of lonely not having your girlfriend because, uh, let's see, I had a girlfriend for about three months, we broke it off, and then I had another girlfriend, like, three months later, and we went out for, like, uh, how many months did we go out for? Like, six months. And then, you know, it went off bad the last few couple of days, and, you know, we broke up. And, you know, it's been like, um... Four months since I've been kind of single, so, you know, I don't know why, but it just it just feels like, it feels kind of sad, you guys know what I mean? Again, I don't want to get too much into it, but, um, how do I say this? Just seeing other people, you know, when I'm, yeah, here's the thing, when I'm, when I was single, um, I really, you know, I never saw people happy in their relationships. I didn't see many people in their relationships. And if they were, they weren't happy at all. But, you know, now I see... Oh, what a fail right there. Now I see... Oh, oh that would have been sick. Now I kind of see, you know, I'm single. And I see all these people happy in their relationships. And, you know, it's kind of sad. I mean, I'm not sure if you guys have had a girlfriend before. Um, I'm not saying that you guys haven't. But I, I'm not sure. I'm not sure if, you know... Ah, whatever, I won't continue on that, but, you know, it gets kind of sad seeing all those people so happy in their relationship, holding their girlfriend, um, holding their girlfriend, hugging their girlfriend, kissing their girlfriend, you know, all that, having a good time, and, you know, it gets kind of sad how you, that's not happening in your life, and you see it all around you, and, you know, you wish you had a girlfriend, but it's just kind of sad for me. I don't know why I'm even talking about this, but... I don't know. Love, love can do some crazy shit to you. Um, it's happened to me a bunch of times. Love... Oh, look, the yellow sign. Again, remember, I'm always going to be doing that. Um, I don't know where I left off right there, but... Um, I don't know. Yeah, love can do crazy shit to you. That's what I was saying. Um... I've been through it. I'm sure some of you have been through it. I'm not sure if everyone has been through it. I'm, I'm sure I have some fans that aren't really at that age, probably, where they, uh, you know, have a girlfriend or something. All right, come on. Get up, Velvet. I guess she doesn't want to get up. Oh, I should have pinned her right there. Um, but, you know, when you guys get in a relationship, be in a relationship that, with a girl that you really like and not a girl you don't like. I mean... I don't know, just, I don't know what the hell I'm saying, to be honest with you. So, you know, since I don't know what I'm saying exactly, don't take everything I say, you know, for granted, or uh, not granted, you know, just don't take everything I say seriously, because I can give some good advice, sometimes I can give some bad advice, but, uh, um, I just li live your life without second thoughts sometimes, but then again, think of what you're doing. I don't know, that's... That's really what's been happening the last uh, couple days with me. It's kind of sad. I mean, I'm not desperate for a girlfriend, but you can say that all the loneliness kind of gets to you after a while. I mean, especially after you've had a girlfriend and, you know, you've done shit. I'm not going to even go far on that. Um, 
<laughs> you've done shit like um, kiss and all that good stuff, you know, hug, you know, get close together, and then, you know, one day it's all over, and, you know, first you're all right with it, but after a couple of months, it's just, just miss that feeling of having a girlfriend. So, um, yeah, that's what it's been really on my mind, like I said a couple uh, seconds ago. It's been on my mind these last few days, and, you know, I just, I've just been thinking a lot. But, uh, you know, it's not depression or anything. Again, I'm not desperate for a girlfriend, but, oh, how the hell did Gail Kim kick out? I mean, Gail Kim Velvet Sky kick out. And I'm not desperate for a girlfriend because I don't want to be in a relationship where I don't have that much feelings for a girl. And that's one thing I'll always, you know, tell you guys. Don't be with a girl unless you have true feelings with her because breaking a girl's heart, it may not mean much to you, but it can really have some effect on the girl. So, yeah, just... Don't, uh, you know, don't break hearts, guys. All right, one. Oh, what the hell is she kicking out? Oh, what the fuck? Uh, come on, come on, come on, come on. How damaged is she? Oh, I guess that explains a lot. Oh, oh freaking Velvet Sky. Come on, I can't lose my number one contendership. I barely freaking got in this match because of last week's. Oh. Yeah, that's shit. Should be it, guys. Let's go for the pin. Come on, ref one. Dog. Oh, gosh, she kicked out. All right, we gotta take her out, guys. We gotta take her out. All right. Uh, oh, she's reversing. At least she's putting some fight into it. Oh, oh, fucking. Oh, I tossed right there. Ah, yeah, whatever. Who cares? Okay. Right, Let's go for that move again. Sorry if I repeat my moves, but I have really. I really just don't know when I repeat moves. Oop. All right, let's go for the top rope. Finish this off with a bang. All right, come on. Ref, one. Oh, how the hell is she kicking out? She's, like, red, guys. Sometimes these characters are freaking OP or something. Oh, come on. Up, oh, leg drop. Again, remember, guys, if this is out of sync, do remember that Sony Vegas is the problem, not Ricardo. No. Oh, it looks like this might be the end for me. Uh-oh. Oh, I was going to escape from the ring. I guess I'll do it. No, I can't. Oh, I kicked out. Come on. She has a finisher, though, so got to be careful. Oh, God damn it. God dang it, guys. I might not win this. Escape from the ring. Escape from the ring. Ring escape. Oh, my God. She almost had me. Oh my god, what the fuck? Good thing this is not a false count anywhere, match. Or else I would have been freaking finished. She is reversing too much. Alright, come on. Get inside, get, get inside the ring. Get inside the ring, get inside the ring. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Come on. And bam! Alright, come on, come on. Let's do the signature. Neck break off! All right, let's get her up, let's get her up, let's get her up. Come on, eat the feet. She's going to be eating the taste of my size 5 foot. I'm not even sure what size Gail Kim is, so, uh, yeah, that was totally made up. Uh, come on, come on, let's go for the pin. Let's put her down in the middle. Don't want to get a freaking rope break, because that will anger me. One, two, and three. We won number one contendership for Gail Kim, guys. We won number one contender night. Next match, uh, I think, it, I believe, uh, it should be Jeff Hardy versus uh, AJ Styles for the number one contendership. Oh, <laughs> handshake right there by the two. That's good to know that, um, you know, maybe I grew a friend. All right, let's, uh, let's go for the next match because it's going to be Jeff Hardy versus, uh, I think, AJ Styles. And if it's not, we'll just, you know, skip the match. No one gets harmed. Alright, what's the next match though? Come on, tell me. Singles, falls count anywhere. Jeff Hardy versus AJ Styles. And I have two pay-per-views coming up this Sunday. I gotta freaking work on it. But again, uh, SmackDown Universe will be uploaded early Saturday, so do not worry about that, guys. Um, again, this week was not filled with my schedule at all the schedule was so messed up uh, this week but you know it's kind of because of school and because of what i just said about you know having some thoughts 
you know, it's just, every once in a while I get these thoughts and, you know, I think to myself, uh, I don't know. I wouldn't say I have a miserable life, but I wouldn't say I have the best damn life in the world. Uh, you guys are probably all like, why are you so being, why are you being so depressive? You're all happy, Ricardo. You're a happy guy. But, uh, yeah, I am a happy guy, guys. I, I always try to keep my biggest, you know, thoughts. My I, I just like keeping my thoughts, you know, what's the word I'm looking for? Positive. I, I find the positives in life, but sometimes there are no positives in life, and that's just the thing. That's that time where you just have to, you know, just think your life through. I'm sure you guys have probably sat through and thought about your life, thought about your family, thought about your girlfriends, thought about your relatives, thought about your loved ones. Or that girl you like in third period that you just want to, you know, hold and kiss. That might be kind of creepy, but, you know, it's, it's nothing, guys. Liking a girl is nothing creepy. Thinking about being with her is nothing creepy. Unless you have weird, dirty thoughts about her, then it's kind of creepy. But uh, we're not going to go there because I shouldn't go there. Alright, this is a False Count Anywhere match, so, uh... Oh, another YOLO sign? All right, come on. Doing some acrobatic moves right here. All right, come on. Aw, oh, Jeff Hardy's reversing it. Come on. Aw, oh, dang it. But yet, yeah, SmackDown Universe expected early Monday because, well, I was, I was sad, guys. I was just... What the hell? Come on. Oh, how does this... All right, let's go outside, AJ. Let's go outside. Get... Get a weapon from under the ring. Get me a chair. Come on, Jeff Hardy. Get out of here. Get out of here. Okay. Oh, Van Daminator. Van Daminator. Nah, let's get a kendo stick. Oh, no, don't hit the fan. Oh, come on. Oh, freaking Jeff. Oh, dang it. Looks like Jeff is getting the advantage, getting some momentum here. But he should not prevail against Rocker X Extra Cardo because Rocker X Extra Cardo is king. By the way, I also plan on doing a series later on called, um, what's it called? You know, Oh yeah, the me versus sub thing series that I was planning on doing, but I never got to it, so expect that soon. So if you guys want to play with me, um, ask me for my gamer tag, or it should be in the description below. If not, I'll get it. Um, it's uh, Dark Mega Goku SS3. Sometimes I'm playing WWE 13. Sometimes I am not because WWE 13 is not the only game in the market, guys. But, you know, it is a great game to, you know, play with subs. I guess I think if I played more online, I would play this game more. But, you know, I have no one to play with. And, you know, playing with randoms sometimes pisses me off. Especially when I have those matches where I can't win. Uh-oh. No. No, Jeff Hardy. Freaking taking my... Finisher. He took my finisher and now he must pay for what he has done. Alright, get up, Jeff. I'm going to freaking kill you. Well, not kill you, but you know, injure you so badly that you wish you were dead in a Russian leg sweep with the kendo stick. Alright. Are we even hitting him up? Did we hit him? Oh, right in the head. That has to freaking hurt. Alright, let's go for a suplex all on the steel steps, and it looks like Jeff Hardy's in pain. Let's go for the chair. Taking my finisher. Taking my pride. What the hell? What's happening? Oh, that was that stupid glitch where it just zooms in on the face. I was about to say, are you kidding me? Oh, smart, Jeff, smart. Oh, of course he would get back out there. Oh, dang it. Alright, let's kick you in the head. Knock some senses into you. Alright, uh, let's, let's do whatever the hell this is going to do. On the seal steps? Oh, so close. Right, let's try again. Or let's try this move. Oh, power bomb. Alright, he'll kick. Uh, let's go for the spiral tap. Oh, I missed. Whatever, let's go for the Style Clash. Go for the Style Clash. Hopefully it has a pin combination. It has a pin combination. Come on, ref. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, freaking ref. Alright, uh, his body's pretty weak, so... 
Let's just do a move. Kick to the head. This should do it. This should do it. All right. Let's go for the bin one. Oh, I hate this about the AI. They always kick out at one. Come on. All right. Oh, Jeff with his reversals. Oh, don't tell me he's going to send me back in the ring. I hate the ring. I hate the ring. Oh, come on, dude. Come on. That's not cool at all. Oh, what the? That was a freaking fail. Uh-oh. Now I'm on the offensive. Oh, go. Got you. Okay, come on. Okay, let's go for that again. Kick to the head. Let's go for a spiral tap. Alright, come on, come on. Spiral tap. Oh, and I got him. Alright, come on, let's go for the win. Hopefully he doesn't kick out a 1-1. One, one, 2 and 3. It looks like I have won the match. AJ Styles wins by pinfall. Alright, uh, let's see if anything happens here, and if nothing happens well, then, um, <sighs> the same cutscene, it's pretty weird, but okay. Notice how both my matches were number one contender matches, and I both, uh, had the same ending cutscene, well, I guess that's pretty much it, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the show, if you guys did, leave a like, and, um, you know, yeah, Rocker X6 out, guys.